a comment. A comment begins with slash star and ends with star slash. At the top of the coding is called preprocessing directive. This section is the place where we specify what compiler should do before compiling the source code. And this is function main definition where the program start its executing. The int at the beginning indicates that function main return value of type integer. Between the curly braces is where we write all the statement that defines what our program does. At the end, we have to include return 0 that indicates the program has terminated successfully. We can execute it by pressing the build and run button to see the output of the program. Part B, variable and data type. Variable is a memory location that can store value. There are four basic data types in C programming language. INT is integer which is a whole number decimal. Plant and double is floating point number. While char is divided by two which is a character and a string. A character for a single letter while a string is series of character. Printf is a standard library function can be used to output information to the display screen between the quotation mark. We can see there is slash n which is called new line escape sequence to print a new line. The first argument consists of conversion specifier percent %d indicates that an integer is to be printed on the monitor screen. The second argument contains the value to be printed represented by a variable. As you can see in a table, is a type of conversion in C programming defines the type of data to be printed. So, let's execute it. As you can see, the value have been printed into the monitor screen. We can also combine these two into a single statement like this. Let's execute it. You can see the same result has produced. It is called initializing a variable by declaring it. What's it? This can have to read integer. Scanf is a standard library function which can be used to input information from keyboard. As you notice in scanf, the variable starts with the ampersand character. This is the address of operator in C programming. It tells the scanf function the location address of the memory is stored in memory. Let's execute it. Part D. Using conversion specifier. As you can see, I use conversion specifier in this coding. The description of specifier has been shown in the table. Let's execute it. Place the data first. So, as you can see, this number will be 155 is consumed as decimal integer, 109 is octal integer, while 345 is hexadecimal integer. Part E. Reading is what we fill with. The fill width specifies the size of field in which output to be printed. If the output values requires more character than the specified field width, the field will be expanded. Otherwise, the field will be blank spaces. The field width is optional. Next, execute it. What F? Filtering character from the input screen. In this coding, you can see the different type of scan F, which is there is nothing here, but in this statement, there are dash, and this statement, they are star. So now let's execute it. As you can see, there is no differences in the output. Although the coding were different. But the printing we filled with and precision. The table shown the example of filled with and precision. So in this coding, I use percent ten D percent 5f and percent 20f so let's see the result now i want to modify this into this okay so now we can see the result this is the result it's all for now we will see next time in experiment 2 goodbye